And we are back and celebrating Spring Fling Week here on PTL, and we are wrapping it up with really something very special. Yeah, what is cuter in the spring than baby animals? I mean, I can't think of much. No. Everything baby. Mikey Hood is live today at the Humane Animal Rescue Wildlife Center in Verona, where they are getting ready for the busy baby season ahead by throwing a baby shower for the animals. Hi, Mikey. Yeah, we are in complete cuteness overload, guys, this morning. Check out this little one, this little squirrel. He's part of the Humane Animal Rescue's Wildlife Baby Shower that is happening this weekend. And I'm here with CEO Dan Rossi. And good morning. Tell us all about it. Well, welcome. Thank you. Know, you. Typically, we're at our East Side Shelter where we're looking at adoptable animals. So we have something really special for you today to really talk about our wildlife center and the amazing things we do here rehabilitating injured wildlife here. Mm -hmm. Katie is our wildlife center director. She yeah. can tell you more about it. All right. Katie, good morning. Good morning. <laughs> All right. So who do we have here? So we have Colleen is one of our licensed wildlife rehabilitators, and she is also a release site coordinator, and she is hand feeding an eastern gray squirrel. Oh, eastern gray squirrel. So is that native to this Pittsburgh area? Yes. They're one of the four uh, squirrel species that we see, or, see here in PA. Um, he's about five weeks. Um, he's starting to be weaned. Um, um, onto a diet so we don't have to hand feed them as often, um, but not quite getting it yet. So Colleen has to step in and help. So cute. So how did you get him? So they came in as an orphan case. Their nest was destroyed and uh, unfortunately mom never came back. Uh, so we did have someone from the public come and bring them in. Yeah. And so is there something that we should know like about squirrels? Like if we run into, if we see one like in our backyard, like a baby squirrel, what do we do? Yeah. So uh, not every squirrel that you see running around is an abandoned orphan. Eventually they do reach an age where they really want to explore and run around. Uh, so mom is usually always a around just watching and observing her young uh, so don't always assume but if you are nervous if you could just watch them for a little bit to see if mom comes back and tends to her young if not just give us a call uh, we do have a hotline operator and he is able to answer phone calls uh, and any questions that anyone may have wow and it's not just squirrels you have who you rescue here it's other animals too right? we do yes um so we rescue everything from great horned owls to raccoons there's only a few species we don't take here uh white-tailed deer bear of all kinds okay, and <laughs> yeah <laughs> no bear um and then also venomous snakes okay great okay everything That's not else here either right um so we, there are some venomous snake species in the state of pennsylvania um but, but not here not this, not in this nope not in this morning. building okay. <laughs> You guys have a big event coming up this week, right? We do. It's our annual baby shower. Um, so it's all to benefit the babies that are coming in. So just like human babies, these babies need a lot of a care and attention and supplies. Um, so we are having a baby shower. Yeah, so speaking of supplies, you guys have a full baby shower table over there. What are some of the things that you're looking for? So we're looking for baby blankets, uh, heating pads, uh, formula, peanuts, uh, any kind of shelled nuts, Cheerios, uh, wet cat food, um, things of that nature. Uh, donated old linens, um, just nothing with holes in them um, but we have already started to collect donations for the shower that's tomorrow yeah and this is all virtual it is it's all virtual which is really great mm -hmm. uh, it starts at 11 a.m. tomorrow so be sure be sure to tune in on Facebook oh so fun all right the wildlife shower tomorrow starts at 11 and it runs until 2 mm -hmm. and if um, people want to donate we'll have the link for you at Pittsburgh today live as to where you can drop off donations as well but for right now I'm going to hang out with this squirrel matter of fact I think he's whispering something to me um, David the squirrel says uh, that when he gets all better he's going to come to your house he knows where you live and he's been hearing all about you <laughs> all right I'm not, I'm not surprised yeah, at all <laughs> yeah that squirrel yeah. in our backyard he's telling every all the other squirrels to come on over all right thanks Mikey I Let's... could watch that little squirrel drink milk all day long. It's hungry. That was so cute. It was cute. Adorable. Cuteness overload. All right, our thanks to Mikey.